My favorite customer. X initiation did not work that time going deep in the base, but when you're in these open areas, it's probably going to be easier. Yeah, it should be a lot easier around this area. Instantly get to kill the ward. Collapse. Still an impossible initiation target here for Talon. They Nala's just want to go on him, and they just walk up and find Q. Be a nice little poke on the clockwork. He is tanky. They get a decent wall. They're going to suck Yatoro back in, but he leaps back out. And 23, he commits his BKB. This has got to be the time where Talon get the Watch fight, the but chrono. the chrono. It's just on 23 Savage. He's, He's tanking it up. Hookshot going to buy some time. Global to try and disengage. Earth Splitter hits absolutely nothing, and Hookshot got stolen. See if Mir can turn it around the Ravage. It catches two on the backside, and the hammer, it comes down and lands as well. Laurel gets picked off, though. 23 going absolutely ham. Took out Yatoro in the middle of all of it. The Water Void is supreme here, and now it is bashing up Collapse. Those ults came up, but they did not do Team Spirit any good as Talon somehow just jam it into the AoE and win the exchange. That was a very... Larless kind of baiting his team, or they're not on the right page. I, I mean, his Chrono is also just not what you want, the solo Warflame. He's the tankiest target for your Toro to punch through. It seems very forced, kind of what is happening in these last fights, but Talon just fully capitalizing on it. Your Toro, he just gets chained up here. There's no global to bail him out this time in 23, man. That Morphling, if he gets away with what he did in this exchange, like getting out of the Chrono, yeah. still has the Faces Void Ags up, and he's just bashing you, chasing you down, throwing out time dilation. Well, 23 